Our team went out all over the world, but this particular encounter took place right here in New Zealand where I'm presently shooting Avatar 2 and Avatar 3 together, a lot of which takes place underwater. Of course, my underwater work on those films was in a tank. Brian got to go out into the real world and have these amazing encounters with these animals. Well, give it another try, huh? Yeah, yeah. Every time he goes into the water with his camera, he stands the chance of seeing something that humans have never observed before. And this encounter with the orca making a peace offering is a perfect example of that. This is such a beautiful moment here when it drops off the, the eagle ray, it says here, this is, this is an offering, you know, welcome. Welcome to our waters. Well, look at this big juicy eagle ray. Wouldn't you just love to have that? Mmm, tasty morsel. And then eventually takes it again. <laughs> it's like, well, if you're not gonna eat that, you know, uh, I think I'll have it back. So they're communicating in the way that they understand. An offering of food is commerce. It's a gift. Now, obviously, they're the apex predator of the ocean. Other whales fear them. Sharks certainly fear them. But there's no known record of an attack by an orca on a human in the wild. So I can only attribute that to their recognition in us of intelligent behavior and their uh, either respect or fascination for that. They must see us in some way very differently than anything else in the ocean. To our knowledge, this is the first time this kind of behavior has been observed. So that's pretty remarkable. <laughs> 